Looks like a Fendi bag. <laughs> she. Firstly, it was. I was. It's shocking. Oh Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Right, go then. So it's considerably darker now because I am in an underground car park. That wasn't the start I was hoping for, for the vlog. Um, but I, if anyone doesn't know, bought a car, finally. It's almost been, it's literally almost been a year since my last one was stolen. It took time for me to heal, but I finally, you know, here I am. Nobody steal this one, or I will cry. <laughs> Don't know why I'm doing that, I will cry. But in this one, in my old car, there was like a clear place I could put my phone. In this one, no clear place. Tried it there, fell on me, nearly dislocated my arm trying to get it out from underneath the seat. So, need, need some work on that. Anyway hi welcome back to my channel i thought i'd do a little autumnal um vlog because i've got some clothing bits i want to show later in the week when they turn up um I promised myself i'd stop spending money but not quite grasped that and i've been saying it for approximately my whole life so don't know when i'm gonna get a grasp on that um so i've got that oh I actually went to a fashion show a few weeks ago. It was so annoying. I wanted to get a vlog out quicker, sooner, you know, so I could show you, but I'll put in some clips on that now because it was really, really cool and it was for charity as well, so I wanted to show you. going to the gym because we've started back you know getting back into exercise said that in a weird way but we started back at the gym and i thought it'd be nice to have charlie back on the channel she's not been on in a while do a little bit of a routine with me not routine because i'm going to a class actually so i'm not gonna be brave enough to film there probably not but then afterwards we want to go to well we i say we but i mean i want to go to asda because i've seen these really really cute um autumnal bedding which i quite liked to try as well so look at me i look like the muscle look at that also the lighting is terrible um and probably the audio is as well because i'm filming on my phone but until i get myself a little portable camera I'll have to. Anyway, I need to go up and get changed ready for the trip. Trim? Trim? Oh my god, my hand's shaking when I try to press the stop button. <laughs> you can barely even see me. Look, I'm just, you know, just a head. And so am I. The car's actually steaming up. But we did the gym class, didn't we? I actually would be more red, but I can't. Stupidly, I kept my makeup on from work and I should have taken it off. It's not very good to keep your makeup on the spot. I did. I feel like I'm hiding. That was really, really hard. I can't, I can't believe how much that. Look at this. Why are you Stephen? <laughs> um, um, I thought, I'm about to die. Like I actually don't think I can speak because I can't breathe. At one point, I was like, I can't even do that. Coming out of it, I feel really good. Yeah. But going into it again, that's going to be hard to go to again because I know what. Oh. Um, I feel like it. It was a blessing in disguise, not knowing what you're going into. Yeah, because you don't get like fat, like you're not, you're not like oh I've got to do like circuits. There was even people like you know the guy on the left side of me. Like I remember when we first got in there, like I think he was talking to her. Like he looked, he looked Jimmy. Like he yeah. looked like he was a regular. And even he was struggling at one point. I looked over and he was like stopped. So it made me feel better about stopping. Yeah, because like even gym goers were like find it hard. And <laughs> yeah, we really started back at the gym. So yeah, but it was good that we went. We did it. Mm -hmm. We kept up with the gym goers. Yes. I'd go again. Would you go again? 
I would go again, but maybe not for like a week. You know, if we go three times a week, I'd, oh, I'd no. definitely only be able to do that once a week. No, that's my cardio, that's my full cardio day. That would be like, I would probably have to do it at the start of the week as well, like when a Monday. More, when you have more when, energy. Yeah, when you're like ready. Yeah, because like. it's Monday today, so that could be a good Monday. Is it Monday today? Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. That could be a good Monday. I can't believe how much it's too long and I'm just so. Uh... <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, there you go, you can see it. There's the gym. Hello, everyone. <laughs> We're in a really dead Lowry. We just watched Don't Worry, Darling. What's your oh thoughts? I've, wait, I told Charlie you're not allowed to tell me your thoughts until I film it. What are your thoughts? Well, firstly, it was, I was in shock. Oh, I thought she was going to a bomb cop. I didn't know anything not about the quite. film. Did you not know watch the trailer? No. I literally seen like one clip of Harry. Um, <laughs> shouting. <laughs> oh, my yes. shouting. That's literally it. Yeah. And like from the first scene, it just seems like it would be like a nice, like, oh, a little romantic film. No, <laughs> it was not. At one point, I was like, yeah, like, what? What? What's going on? <laughs> But I was actually, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, I thought it was good, but... So I got told there's this big twist at the end, and I'm not going to lie, I, I guessed the twist. Yeah, I guessed it. There was one point, you know, when um, it was like a flashback, the first flashback. Yes. And as soon as that had happened, I thought, I know what's going on here. Yeah, and um, there's one other part, so... Also, how weird that I was talking about Black Mirror before we went in. I just oh was God. getting the Black Mirror vibe the whole way through. Yeah. And so I just, I kind, I kind of did know. But well, so you got it even earlier than that. Yeah. I don't. Know. I just, I just knew. Oh, I'm right. just such a film. Some of us are as good as you, <laughs> I guess. Now we're in the nice <laughs> M City. This isn't the nice part actually. Our garden. I know our garden <laughs> in the backyard. But yeah, there were our thoughts. Hope we didn't actually give any spoilers. Yeah, no, hopefully not. Um, well, I actually am impressed by Harry. I think he did very well. I actually also <laughs> agree. Like again, I was going into it thinking he was going to be absolutely shocking. Yeah. But, oh God, cuddle. There was a couple of bits that made me laugh when he was supposed to be being serious and like shout. There was a bit where we walked off and he was like, "Fuck's sake, good <laughs> <laughs> breath." And I actually laughed at that bit. It was like a serious. <laughs> But like overall, I thought he wasn't as bad as people I've seen people say it. This um, reminds me of taking selfies. In I know. Photo. I'm on the back camera, so I don't. Um, do you do this? I do. <laughs> or like you'd hide, like loads of people hide their faces. Oh my god, that's what they do now these days. They hide their face. Anyway, I just thought I'd quickly add something in because we both got here. Charlie, you hold on, and I'll hold oh, on. I've got great hair. Oh, swap. I have to have my own. And um, look, we've both got the exact same Amazon package because... Right, I'm going to do this. Right. <laughs> now. Because we've both got the same package. Here are you. We've both got the same thing for one reason and one reason only. Oh. <laughs> Seems like you don't like yours as much as I like mine. <laughs> okay, ready? Yeah. <laughs> now it might seem weird that we've bought the same book because really you're probably thinking well why didn't you just borrow it when neither one was done yeah but we've joined a book club well joined we actually started one we are the founders <laughs> of the book club yeah so here we go this is the first one which is quite fitting because it's called book lovers yeah thought just add that in I'm gonna start it tonight Very one exciting. summer two rivals a plot twist they didn't see coming If you can hear in my voice, which you probably can, I'm trying to disguise it with the makeup, but I am pretty ill. And this is the first time this month that I've been really ill. So my immune system is just plummeted. I, I even had to buy vitamins the other day to try and, you know, do something about it. I'm gonna eat loads of veg, I'm gonna drink loads of water, but I just don't know, anyway. I'm jumping back on the end of this vlog to kind of, you know, sum up all my activities. So obviously I went to the gym, I showed you that fashion show finally, uh, we went to see Don't Worry Darling, 
and I tried to get bedding but I just can't find any because obviously this bedding <laughs> luckily nice and behind me is lovely I absolutely love it but it is a little bit spring and summery do you know what I mean like flowers but I wanted like an autumn version of this like something white with pumpkins on and I'm pretty sure Asda did it but I couldn't find it so that's a shame but you know save the pennies and don't buy anything unless you really love it that's my advice to you <laughs> anyway I don't know why I'm preaching not to buy things because this whole point of the video is because I've bought things I've got some mango I've got some lush I have some ASOS too I also have Yudico but it's not a bag so I didn't want to really you know ruin the surprise um, so first I bought this from I go oh my god my nose I bought this from Mango ages ago and it is first thing I want to show is this black skirt now if you watch my other video you know my kind of hunt for a black skirt because I was at the tram stop, had my other black skirt ripped, it was really embarrassing, blah blah blah, you've heard the story. So I'm on the hunt for another black skirt. This one I saw on a girl on TikTok, because again, when do I not buy things because I see them on TikTok? Um, and it has a stretchy band, ideal, and I think it's the right length. I need to obviously try it on, but you know, with like um, sheer like black tights or brown tights, boots, very autumnal. Hopefully I found the good replacement. Then next from Mango, I got this bag. Now if you are oh, brilliant, I'm glad I got my light out today because you can really see the pattern on it. And this looks like a Fendi bag, but it's not, it's an M for Mango. And Mango do some incredible bags and I'll tell you who got me on this, Pete Moonstein. Pop a pick over here. Um, who I also went to the fashion show with, actually. Peen, you should probably be in my videos. Because she's also a big Sky Sports presenter now as well. So, that's pretty cool. So if you know who she is, she's my friend first. Um, but yeah, she got me onto this bag. She has a nice green one. Maybe I'll borrow that one. She can borrow my black one. We can swap and change. Okay, next I'll do the thing that's not in a bag. This is from Uniqlo because I had a jump shoot. Jump shoot? <laughs> I had a jump... Oh my god, I had a jumpsuit from Uniqlo that I bought in summer. It was really, really nice. It just fell really weird on my hips. That made me look like genuinely like a pair. Um, so it took this long to kind of sort it and take it back. But I finally have, and instead I swapped it for. So this wasn't even, this wasn't even spending money really. Well, it was, but um, I swapped it for some dark, dark blue jeans because. I saw, I saw a cool Insta girl, <laughs> I saw a cool girl on Instagram wearing dark jeans and so I had to buy dark jeans. Next I'll do Lush. Now, if you, if you know me, you probably already know what's in this bag. Because, oh, I've got some Boots bubbles in there. That's not, that's not what I was going to show but you always need bubbles and these are my favourite ones. If you ever cared. These are really good. Okay, shut up. <laughs> Nobody cares about bubbles. But uh, this. Holy moly, this is my favourite thing in the world. And it only comes out around this time of year and stays till Christmas um, because obviously it's Snow Fairy. Everyone knows Snow Fairy. Everyone knows the Snow Fairy scent. It's usually people getting the body wash. No, I don't get the body wash, I get the body spray because this sticks on you for hours. Like, honestly, I have gone all the way to work and then, like, faffed around, then got out for a meal, and someone said, I can smell lush, and it, it was me. <laughs> that was a whole day's work, whole day's faff, then out for a meal, and it was Sylvia, and I hadn't reapplied, and just everyone could smell it. Every, you just smell nice, you smell really nice. And then, not gonna lie, it is a little bit on the sickly side, it's very, very sweet. So if you don't like that, you probably won't like this. Okay, <laughs> next is ASOS. It's coming up to winter. I've got a little bit of a cold. I thought I need to wrap up a bit more. So I got, 
a really big scarf. Now I'm hoping it's as big as the picture. I was going to go for a deep, deep blue, but then I went for this this blue in the end because I think it goes with my hair a little bit more. I don't know. Wow, it's big. Okay, let's put it on. Perfect. <laughs> okay, so that's my scarf, and that's the last thing that I bought as well. And I severely can't buy anything else. I've also become obsessed with words severely, and I keep using it really when it shouldn't actually be used. So that's that's me that's my flaw of the month what's yours um <laughs> anyway and yeah i think that's everything i wanted to share this week i know it's a little bit um it wasn't i didn't think i posted last week but genuinely it's because i've felt like i've been hit by a truck so i've been so ill <laughs> like it's so annoying i hate being ill as well although i love to moan and complain about being ill it's really quite annoying so, yeah, I've got my vitamins now, so hopefully they'll help. Anyway, I have got a, a video planned for next week, so hopefully I will recover, and I'll be back next week. Anyway, that's all for now. <laughs> what? I actually feel insane. Anyway, goodbye. Love you all.